praise the Lord, praise Our Lady of Anaju. I'm Lina from Hong Kong. Uh, this is my eighth time to coming to Anaju. My first time was in October 2016. I was setting out in the morning with my one-year-old son in my arms. I fell and swear my foot. When we arrived at the airport, I found that my leg hurts and I had to walk it really hard and painful. So that's how I arrived in Naju. And then next day, uh, I play on the station, of course, and then took a shower in with the miracle water. And then in this way, the five-day trip ends until it was time to return to Hong Kong. As I was leaving um, to return to Hong Kong, and then I remember that my foot wasn't pain when I set off. And then I'm thinking, why did it hurt at all these days? When will it get better? It hurts so much when I choose it. Why don't I seem to have any pain these days? I was here without any medicine in those few days. It's my first experience of being healed in my life. So uh, from that time, I was very feeling, very strong feeling about the Naju, very Good. special, I think, that place. So after I come back, I just want to swear Naju to China. I don't know why, but in my heart, I have that thinking. So uh, I want more Chinese uh, Catholics and priests to know about Naju. So I keep working on it, spreading the message of the Naju and sending them many relatives' books, videos, holy items, and uh, holy water. And before COVID-19, they have a free priest uh, have come to Naju. Because uh, I'm thinking all the time is that if I do the first step, God will do the rest and will give them uh, the grace and then let them receive it. The result is not important. The important thing is that I did it and let the rest to the God. So in this way, I share about Naju more than 10 pieces every day. And then we have shared it about over four years about the message of Naju. And I'm very grateful and happy in my heart because they are all respond with Amen. They also were very angry to come to Naju. Every time when I miss the peace, I just miss, I will introduce Naju to them immediately. And also I will send Mama Julia's story from the book of the five Swati and two people while the WeChat. Uh, and then after they reading them, one of the ladies, she forgave her mother-in-law. And also I send the Naju holy water to people, uh, hope them can receive the healing grace. And many people were healed, especially one old lady whose feet have uh, rotten for more than 30 years. She wasn't still can't recover after seeing many daughters. But my father prayed for her and used the holy water about three to four times. Then she healed. Before it's like that. Okay. After three and four times uh, healed. Never so everyone witnessed this grace and they are friends Our Lady of Naju. So the last thing I want to share is about Mama Julia. Friends God arranged an opportunity to approach her. This is where I got this blessing. In 2018, she came to Hong Kong. At that time, Father Joseph Fu's kidney function was at zero percent. He could hardly walk and had four serious illness. He was said to go to the hospice, the last place for very sick patients. When Mama Julia earnest pay for Father Fu, I witnessed Father Fu was healed through Mama <laughs> Julia's <laughs> <prayer. laughs> Thanks to this reception, I got to know Mama Julia more. She always covered her pain with smile. And her generous love moved me very much. Last year, I visited Naju for the first time since pandemic for the 38th anniversary. A few weeks ago, before going, I had soreness, stiffness, pain, and dizziness, which made me very difficult. When Mama Julia took a photo with us, I stood behind her and called her Oma. At that moment, Mama Julia pressed my neck <laughs> and I was free from the stiffness, sensation and this dizziness. I'm healed, no more pain. Praise the Lord. And uh, praise the Lord. Finally, I want to say uh, is that I experienced God's love for me in Naju. God changed me in Naju and I felt love deeply in my heart. He also took good care of my family and my three children. I have always been grateful to the Lord and the Blessed Mother for letting me know about Naju. And I thank you, Mama Julia, for being a channel for all this great blessing. Thanks God, bless them, Lady Naju. I love you, Mama Julia. Thank you.